While we have some brilliant folks with us in the world today, they almost don't even compare to some of the smartest people that have ever lived. Here, we've gathered a list of exceptional scientists, philosophers, composers, engineers, and more, so that you can gain an understanding of just how genius many before us truly were. Sit back and prepare to feel like you've got an IQ similar to that of gum on a boot. This is our list of greatest minds of all time. 10. Socrates No, Socrates wasn't just a character from Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure. He was a real guy, and he was one of the smartest real guys ever. He was a Greek philosopher who helped to found Western philosophy as we know it, and he's often credited as being the first moral philosopher. The thing about Socrates is that he didn't write down his thinkings. He taught them to others, such as Xenophon and Plato, and they were eventually written down after his pupils gave accounts of what he taught. Socrates' teachings are mainly known through Plato's dialogues, but no one knows how much of them are genuinely Socrates and how much are Plato himself. Through what Plato reported, Socrates gained recognition for contributions to epistemology and ethics, as well as giving us the Socratic method and pointing out the concept of Socratic irony. 9. Archimedes this Greek mind was an astronomer, physicist, engineer, mathematician, and an inventor, and he's considered one of the greatest scientists of his time. Some mathematicians and historians even go so far as to say he may be the greatest mathematician ever. He saw mathematical analysis and calculus coming way before they were even things, and he used various concepts from these to solve a number of problems, including the volume and surface area of a sphere, the area of a circle, and a bunch of geometrical theorems. He created the system in which we can show large numbers on a small scale, exponentiation. He managed to understand that we can use mathematics to figure out physical phenomena, and was the first to do it. He accurately approximated pi, he designed compound pulleys, the screw pump, and even war machines like the heat ray. We also got the Archimedes principle from him. Oh yeah, he did all of this way back when he was alive, between 287 and 212 BC. 8. Mozart this amazing composer was actually born Johannes Chrysostomus Wolfgangus Theopetus Mozart, which is the Latin form of his name, but mostly went by Wolfgang Amad Mozart as an adult. He was a prodigy, and we aren't just saying that. By the age of five, he was performing on the violin and piano for European royalty. By 17, he was a part of the Salzburg court, but things just weren't stimulating enough for him, so he looked elsewhere to find a better position. He moved to Vienna, where he found fame and composed a literally insane number of operas, concertos, symphonies, and some portions of a requiem. He passed away at 35 on December 5, 1791, and his death has been much mythologized over the years, considering no conclusive cause of death has ever been found. He left behind a legacy, though. Wolfgang Amad Mozart composed over 600 works in his short time on Earth, and his musical mind will forever be regarded as one of the best there's ever been. 7. Nikola Tesla Without this man, you probably wouldn't even be able to watch this video right now, nor would we have been able to create it. Nikola Tesla was a Serbian-American genius, with his hands in all kinds of things. He was a mechanical engineer, an electrical engineer, an inventor, and a futurist all wrapped up into one cool-looking man. He had nearly 300 patents, and was an inventor so prolific, it would have been hard to even comprehend his ideas at the rate he was bringing them to life. Tesla played a role in X-ray technology, he created one of the very first remote controls, and controlled a boat from a distance with it, and he and Guillermo Marconi were rivals in the radio business. That's not all. He invented things like the electromechanical oscillator, the Tesla coil, and he was a huge part of why and how one of the world's first hydroelectric plants worked. The last one has to do with his invention of an AC induction motor, the reason we have powers in our homes, businesses, and everywhere today. His technology paved the way for the here and now, and the future of electricity distribution. Talk about one incredible and important mind. 6. Plato As a student of Socrates, you know that Plato had to be one smart cat. He was a philosopher from Athens back in the classical period, and he founded the Academy, which was a school of thought. He was a pivotal thinker in both Western and ancient Greek philosophy, and is associated with the biggest names ever to have come from the discipline. Socrates, who was his teacher, and Aristotle, who was his pupil. 
All of you religious folks, did you know that many cite Plato as one of the founders of Western spirituality and religion? And it's pretty much certain that he's the founder of Western political philosophy. But his most famous and exciting contribution to philosophy, and the world at large, was Platonism, which is basically just his philosophy and other systems that are drawn from it. He has around 250 surviving manuscripts, and these manuscripts have had readers from the time they were written and haven't stopped since. It seems safe to say that they won't be forgotten anytime soon either. 5. Aristotle Following this trail of philosophers down the line brings us to Aristotle, the student of previously mentioned Plato. Now, Aristotle was a Greek philosopher as well, just as his predecessors were, and he managed to develop a harmonious blend of philosophies that came before him. He used a little bit of Socrates, a bit of Plato, and a mixture of other ideas as well, to form and inform his thinking. And then, he taught his thoughts to the world. It is mostly from these teachings that the West took its methods of inquiry, problems, and fundamental intellectual lexicon. His philosophies have had a hand in pretty much all forms of knowledge in the West, and his teachings continue to influence all forms of thought and intellect today. Did you know that Aristotle taught Alexander the Great? Doing so also opened up great opportunities for him, including getting the library in the Lyceum established, which afforded him the chance and place to write hundreds of his books. Only about a third of his writings have survived, leaving room to wonder just what else we could have gleaned from this genuinely brilliant man. 4. Galileo Galilei This next amazingly smart and talented guy pretty much established astronomy as we know it. But he was more than just an astronomer. He was also an engineer, a physicist, and is at times referred to as a polymath, or someone who has knowledge about a lot of different subjects. He is called the father of many things, including observational astronomy, the scientific method, modern physics, and modern science. He studied many things and came up with inventions, like a range of military compasses and the thermoscope. In astronomy, he's credited with finding the four large satellites surrounding Jupiter, which are now called the Galilean moons. He also analyzed sunspots, studied Saturn, and confirmed the phases of Venus. Both Albert Einstein and Stephen Hawking looked to Galileo as the father and creator of modern science. And if that doesn't say something about him, we don't know what would. 3. Isaac Newton Also known as Sir Isaac Newton, as he was knighted in 1705 by Queen Anne, he was, as many consider, one of the most influential scientists ever, and was an astronomer, mathematician, physicist, author, theologian, and described himself as a natural philosopher. One of his most significant contributions to science and mathematics was what is often referred to as Principia, which was published in 1687. He helped develop the infinitesimal calculus, the theories of universal gravitation, and laws of motion, and used his thoughts on gravity to account for many occurrences, such as the trajectories of comets and the tides. Newton also built the Newtonian telescope, or the first practical reflecting telescope, figured out that prisms can divide white light, and did many other things in his lifetime that we can't even try to go into here. This video would run quite long if we did so, and we won't even pretend that we fully understand everything that he did. Newton was an incredibly brilliant mind, and without him, we wouldn't have a lot of the technologies or ideas about the world that we have today. 2. Albert Einstein Chances are, when you think of some of the greatest thinkers ever, Albert Einstein is one of the first people that comes to mind. Einstein was a German prodigy and theoretical physicist who developed many laws and theories that hold water in the scientific world of today. Probably his most recognized and famous contribution to science is the theory of relativity, which stands as part of the backbone of modern physics along with quantum mechanics. He also has a formula that is quite popular and well-known to just about everybody, E equals mc squared. This equation is often referred to as the world's most famous equation, and it is called the mass-energy equivalence formula. He also discovered the photoelectric effect, which aided in the forming of quantum theory. In his lifetime, Einstein was able to publish more than 300 scientific papers, and there were also 150 non-scientific works as well. He too did many other things throughout the course of his 76 years on Earth, but if we went into all of them, you might be sitting here for the next couple of hours. We've seen some extremely brilliant minds so far, and if you can believe it, we still have one more to go. But first, we'd like to ask you, who do you think has made the biggest contribution to the understanding we have of the world today? Who would you like to see on a future list of greatest minds? Let us know in the comments below. 1. Leonardo da Vinci 
This famous Italian is referred to as a polymath, and he was an expert in so many different areas of study. His interests included things like painting, drawing, writing, sculpting, architecture, literature, music, science, inventing, engineering, astronomy, geology, botany, cartography, history, and mathematics. You can probably see why he was so smart, although he had to be smart to study most of these things in the first place. Scholars, historians, and laypeople alike often refer to him as the universal genius. And that's only fair, considering he's one of the most diversely talented individuals to have ever graced the Earth with his presence. You've probably heard of some of the things he's achieved in his lifetime, as pretty much everything he did is still important today. The Mona Lisa is one of his many famous works of art, but it's definitely the most famous, probably followed by his drawing called the Vitruvian Man. He also drew out concepts of solar and water power, armored war vehicles, and even flying machines. Keep in mind that all of the things he did, he did between 1452 and 1519, which is as mind-blowing as it is unbelievable. His genius will more than likely never be rivaled, which is why he makes the top spot on our list of greatest minds of all time. If this video got you thinking yourself, do us a favor and give it a like. Subscribe to our channel below or by clicking on our logo right here so that you never miss out on any of our amazing uploads. And be sure to check out this next video that we picked out just for you.